Only 1% of the country's population, but 40% of all crimes in France are directed toward the Jewish community there. And the anti-Semitism is not just in France. According to the FBI, here in the United States, Jews are four times more likely to be victims of hate crimes than Muslims and nine times more likely than Christians. So why are politicians and pundits focusing their worry on vi uh, violence against the Muslim community? Uh, Fred Fleitz is a former CIA analyst and a senior fellow with the Center for Security Policy, which released its own study on religious hate crimes. He joins us now set the stage on this. Uh, Fred, great to see you this morning. First of all, define for us what is a hate crime? Well, a hate crime is a crime against an ethnic group or, or a religious group or a group on uh, social orientation. It's tracked closely by the FBI and, and other, other uh, legal authorities. And as you said, there, there have been far more of these crimes against Jewish Americans than against Muslim Americans. And Fred, you say that uh, that the left is very worried about Islamophobia um, in in the wake of of these shootings, yet ignoring crimes against Jews. What evidence do you have to back that up? We did an important study that we released in 2011, based on to, to try to assess claims by the news media and and Muslim groups that there was a spike in uh, anti-Muslim uh, attacks after 9/11. There was a spike for about nine weeks and then it trailed off. But even during that nine week period, there were twice as many attacks against Jewish Americans than against Muslim Americans. Huh. And, and do you think those attacks came from Muslims or Muslim groups? Well, in, ter in the United States, I don't know that the attacks against uh, Jews were against Muslims. But in France, there's simply no doubt that the surge uh, in, in immigrants from Muslim countries has caused an enormous increase, almost a seven times increase from the 1990s against French Jews. All right, Fred, we uh, have to leave it there this morning as we continue to follow the breaking news out of France at this hour. Fred, thanks so much for joining us. We appreciate it. Good.